So I had this strawberry plant. There's actually two plants in this container. Um, it's looking a little cut back just because I brought it in for the winter. And um, I'm not sure if this tag, yeah, it was an everbearing. But the really neat thing about these two plants were, was that the blooms, you can still see one on here, were fuchsia and like a fuchsia red bloom, which was really, really cool. Something different. I found this at a garden center out near the lake. And um, anyhow, I brought it in because I know I can winter them over. And it was just pretty to have, it was nice and full and green and it had little pretty flowers on it and then neat little strawberries on it. Um, not really anything to having a recipe or anything, but they were sweet and tasty. Just a few, just nice little surprises, right? Growing in this terracotta pot. So my pot fell over uh, within the last two weeks after moving it out here. And I noticed these two berries. <laughs> I've never seen anything like this. There are actual little leaves coming out of the strawberry, which the strawberry has its seeds on the fruit, as you can see here. So I did a little research and apparently this is called vivipary, um, <laughs> which means there's green shoots emerging and you can still eat the fruit, but I'm not going to do that. I'm actually going to, um, keep it going and see what ends up happening here if I get a bunch of little plants coming out or I'm not quite sure what would happen but this is pretty interesting we're just gonna let nature do its thing here and I'm gonna keep an eye on it and make sure it's getting what it needs maybe I'll end up putting it into soil um, just to keep those plants to keep coming but we'll see how cool is that pretty fun. So I've just been gradually carrying things in like I do every year. It gets piled a little. A lot of weed weeding back to do now that we've had an odd really warm day. And there's where I stuck that strawberry plant just up off the ground close to the light but it stays pretty cool over here. It's just a little, little container. I'll bring it over here so we can see it a little better. Look at that. Isn't that something? It's getting dark in here. Sun's already setting, so I don't really have good super good light but look at that isn't that crazy oh my gosh there's two of them doing that actually um that one's the most i don't know if these two are gonna do it three are gonna do it oh my goodness how cool is that oh this one here it is look at that look at that it's like i'm having new plants i didn't notice any um Usually I get the shoots coming off these with new growth, new plants come off the shoots, but I didn't notice any of that on this plant. It just got really full and then I pruned it back when I brought it in because what's gonna happen anyhow is when it gets used to the cooler temperatures in here, the leaves will drop. But then come February when it's sun's getting higher and it's warming up in the dome here, this thing will be full again, so. We'll see what happens. This is cool.